your book, A Man's World. Yeah. Why? So, when I first hit the tabloids years and years ago, um, I was asked if I wanted to do a book then, revealing exactly what I've been doing in my previous job, because bear in mind, this was well over a decade ago that I did this line of work. That's my point. Yeah, so, well, this is what I'm trying to explain. So, everyone kind of says, why would you bring this up now? I'm not bringing this up now. Of what you I, are, you've written no, a book. Yeah. And I'm doing this because this is something I've learned to live with. You're bringing it back only up, one, but, but not, you're bringing it I'm back up bringing again by bringing up. this book out, you I'm are. I'm not bringing it back up. It comes out in the tabloids. Right, so to you it's coming back up and to other people, I've learned to live with this. So if I go into a restaurant and someone asks me about this, that's someone else bringing it up. People have took an interest in my life. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use that because, yes, it's in the papers every now and then. And do you know what I'm sick and tired of? I'm sick and tired of people writing rubbish about me and people saying So this is putting the record straight. Thing. Yeah, it's putting the record straight. It's closure. And more importantly, I want people to realise that are interested in me because for some unbeknown reason people are interested in me, that... The Wayne Rooney thing is a drop in the ocean. Because there's bigger fish to there's, fry. There's so many other things. You I mean there's more... Because of the, you, you can't name everybody and you're not going to do that it's now because... It's just about that. It's about my life. It's a biography. But, it's but about you, why you, I think... Don't, don't take this the wrong way, because it's fascinating to hear your take on this, but the truth of the matter is, and, and we are all in the public eye for whatever reason, right? But yeah. this book, you say, is set to be released... Um, there are perhaps other people. Are you naming the other people that you slept with? The people that I have decided to name in the book are people that screwed me over, basically. So but you just said that, that you're not bringing it back. You undoubtedly are bringing yeah, this no. back. No. You are. People who... How is it bringing it back? It's there all the time for me. Something was brought out... A super injunction was brought out on me when I hadn't. I never had an intention. I'm talking about that. I'm talking about these, these you know, the, the question marks they did the other... What I'm trying to say to the you question is, right, marks, if, so if who, people who watching this... This went. If people just, watching this just bear went... in mind, please just bear in mind, Jeremy, that we're going off what media writes. So when something's saying, oh, she's doing this, that and the other, it's it's clickbait. It's yeah. getting the people in, of course it so is. So this is putting the record straight. It's about everything. It's about a ton of things that I really, really... I, I can confidently believe now that women will be able to read this book. And this isn't about men bashing. It's not about me hating on men. It's about why women do certain things. There's more what, to me. What, sleep with married footballers? Yeah, of course, exactly. There's, that's, a, that's nothing. That's just a blip. It's nothing. But that's the reason there's a book. No, it's not. But your book wouldn't so, be published so be, if you hadn't slept with Wayne so Rooney, people, with respect, would it? So hang on. So people who write biographies, have they all slept with footballers? Or do people write biographies? I'm only... I'm only listen, I'm only... Listen, people write listen I'm asking you what people would people want me write. to ask. Would anybody publish your book unless you'd slept with Wayne Rooney? And the question is, ten years ago, yes. and I absolutely get yes. when I've read you... Yes. They'd have written your book. Why? No, 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 no. People would still be interested in publishing my book because of the other stories that I've never been able to sit and tell. This isn't about, what, like, what, what I don't mean names. Other don't stories, mean, what, what names. can we expect? The stories to do with my childhood, the stories to do with why I've done certain things, the stories to do with why I've behaved in a certain way. This isn't like me pointing the blame at certain no. people. but people are very, responsibility. People are, yeah, people are very, very quick to judge but aren't actually interested in saying, well, actually, Helen, how come you came about doing this? Yeah. Why did you do this? It's I get that. This, I get isn't, that. Just, this isn't just the that. escorting. This is about everything but as what, a I get whole. That. What, I've never what they had might the chance say is, to write everything. What they might say is, as a woman... Don't you feel a certain amount of disrespect to the wives? In the sense that, of course, the men are the ones who've done the cheating. Totally But by that. you bringing but... it up in this way, and I know you say it's around for you every day in your life, but other people are trying to get on with their lives and get beyond these yeah, episodes, and so aren't am they? I. Um, well, we've so... asked Wayne Rainey for a comment. He's made no comment, so we so, don't want to cast hang on, on in their an idea, marriage. In an ideal world, I would never, ever... I wouldn't be sat here now. You wouldn't know who I, who I am. Jenny Thompson decided to sell my name yeah. for £10,000 Well, this is an paper. interesting point, because you and so, she are at loggerheads. You, um, no-one would know who I was. So, unfortunately, I'm making the most of it. So, if people want to know why I did certain things, then I will tell them in my own words. I'm sick of newspapers writing my words. Jenny Thompson, you blame for this, don't you? Of you course say it that, that... There's proof. There's proof. The, a lady from the News of the World said to me, which is totally out of nature for a journalist, which I'm sure you can agree, the journalist said to me, after all this came out, 
This isn't really something I do, Helen, but I have a soft spot for you. Never speak to that girl again. She sold the story. We waved £10,000 in front of her. She gave us your face off Facebook and she got an extra... But let me, out. let me, just she do me a favour, just do me a favour one she second. She never had to no, sell no, that's fine, fine. I'm not disagreeing with you, just hear me out one second. If you were, people watching this this morning, if they take that view that your friend Jenny Thompson, you acknowledge what you did, but Jenny ex -friend, Thompson, ex-friend, right, did what she did, I go back to what I said at the beginning and you have not answered it, which is, if she did you wrong by outing you, if this has been ten years and you're at a different stage in your life and actually now, you, why the hell are you bringing it up again and it's writing a it's book? Not That's what we want. It's it is. It's closure. Jeremy, all for I can you, say is... Not for, for Colleen me, Rooney. That's all I'm a, saying. It's not about her. It's about me. It's about me. OK. OK. Am I not allowed to do something for myself? Absolutely, and I hope your Every, book sells. People, people write biographies all the time. This, will, it, this book will prove that that is just something small about um, my life. Can I okay. ask you a question? Um, looking back over your life, do you wish you hadn't gone into escorting? No, not at all. Don't regret it. I can't sit here and say that I regret it because I openly ta I've openly talked about it. I did what I did and it was nobody else's fault. I'm not pointing the finger at anybody, but I don't regret doing that, no. To be fair to you, you've come here today, uh, you're talking about your memoir, A Man's World. Both Jenny Thompson and Wayne Rooney were approached by, by GMB. They did not want to say anything. I I'll give this to you. Look, it's very easy, isn't it, for people to say this, that and the other. From my point of view, I get, actually, that it happened. It was at a different stage of your life. I've made my point twice. You've decided to write it. That's your business. Um, at the end of the day, it's, it's a shame, isn't it? If I ask you one final question, I'm sure you don't want to be known forever as the woman who slept I always with will be. Well, now, you see, there's an interesting point. I always point. will be. Now, this is where I will and take... Book, I'll take your side a second. This book might change things. Right, well, I'll take your side. We were talking about this off-air, right? Whatever I do, I'll be that bloke that shouts at people in the morning. So I'll take, I'll take that absolutely. Yeah. But all I'm saying is they're short... You know, maybe this is closure. For me. Maybe Big Brother... I don't know, but just after that, maybe you it, should let it go. Yeah, it's closure for me, yeah. We it's, hope it gives you that it, closure, though, Helen. It will do. And thank you for coming on the thank show you. this morning. Uh, Helen Wood's memoirs, A Man's World, uh, released at the end of next month, is that right? Uh, June the 3rd. Have you given us a signed copy this morning? I've got to buy one. You definitely don't want one of them, do you? <laughs> If it's free. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if you're giving it to me free, Helen Woods, I will certainly undoubtedly read it. That didn't sound right, but I knew what I meant.